Hi guys, welcome back. I hope all is well and everyone have a great week this week. It is Monday. Happy Monday. And it is also National Coloring Book Day. So I thought I would share with you my favorite coloring books. Maybe two or three you've seen before when I posted the video, my favorite coloring books. But all of these, most of these are new. So these are mostly my new favorite coloring books. But I think three I've showed you before. So I guess that's my top three. <laughs> I don't know, but let's get started. And today is August 2nd. Rita Berman. Everybody know, if you have been following me for some time, you know that Rita Berman is my favorite illustrator. So this is the compilation book. It has all of the images from all of the different books in this one. I love this book. I love Rita Berman. She is, she will always be my favorite illustrator. And I can't, I cannot wait until her new book come out this month. So I've already pre-ordered. So I'm super excited about that. This is Rita Berman. My next is new. I'll move you up a bit. This next one is new. This is the Drea books, the Drea Draws books. Um, I could not find the other one because I don't have one, but I have two. I don't know what I, I don't know where it's somewhere on the bookshelf, but I love these books. These books are awesome. I recommend these books. I like the grayscale edition of these books. They are just super cute. They are beautiful. I love them and I love grayscale. So, you know, this is totally my thing and her illustrations are just the cutest. She's so talented. I love her books. Um, Drea Draws, The Coloring Beauties, Coloring Oceans. Um, I love these books. They are awesome. I will have the link below to all of these books um, so you can go and purchase whatever books you may want to purchase. You guys know this is one of my favorite. Rose windows, all the paper hanging out the side because I'm working on a project in it at the moment. And after that project, I have two pages left and I will be finished with the book. I'm kind of sad, but... I knew it would come to an end one day. So I really hope this illustrator, Joe Averin, come out with a new book like this. Because this book is awesome, guys. And I'll show you a couple of my finished pages in this book. I use Sharpie for this one. What I use for this one? Oh, hoo hoo. This is one of my favorites. I use Big Intensity. I love Big Intensity in this book. Really, on Creative Haven paper, Big Intensity works well. And this is one I just finished. I used Cali Art on that one. But yeah, I just wanted to share a few finished pages with you. I love this book. Super awesome book. This is Rose Windows. My next book was one of my original favorites, Manic Botanic. Um, I've only completed one and a half in this book. I did this one last year. I'm very happy how it turned out. I use Arteza um, pencils and I also use stickles. And I am halfway finished with a new one that I've just started working on for the month. But I'm not going to share that right now because I'm not finished with it. But this is Manic Botanic. Don't let this book intimidate you. Once you start, you will like it. This is a new favorite. <clears throat> this is Floating Island by Coco Wayo. I have not colored anything in this book, but I love the illustrations in this book. And I can't wait to color something in this book. Hopefully that will be this month. 
But this is Floating Island by Coco Wayo. <clears throat> Next is Fairy Touch of Magic. And the reason why this is one of my new favorites, it's so busy and it totally intimidates me, okay? <clears throat> I'm totally intimidated by this book. But one day I'm going to tackle a page in this book. The paper is awesome. I love it. The paper is cream, which I really like, but I want to color a page in this book. And I honestly don't think it would be as bad as I think it is. But this book is very, very busy, as you can see. <clears throat> like, look at this two-page spread. That's busy. But I think I can do it, and I'm going to do it. I'm going to tackle it. So this is one of my new favorites. I love the book, though. Yeah, it's busy, but I love it. This is Fairy Touch of Magic by Clara Markova. My next book is also a new favorite. This is Tales from the Midnight Masquerade by Hannah Carlson. I love this book. I love this paper. And I love how this picture came out. I used um, Holbein's on this picture, gel pen, and glossy accents. I love how this came out. Oh, and um, chalk pastels. This was a super fun page. And this was a color along for my group. I don't remember which one, but it was for my group. This was super fun and it came out great. I think I did pretty good with the whole binds on this one. Really, really fun. To me, those whole binds worth work good in this book. World Within Worlds, another book that totally intimidates me, but hey, it's still one of my favorite. And hopefully I can get something done real soon in this book. But it is a very busy book. But it's just a beautiful book. It's very beautiful. And I want to finish. I want to do a project in this book one day. Soon. This is World Within Worlds by Cobra Rosanis. That's a new favorite. This is also a new favorite. Well, I call this a new favorite. I never showed it to you guys, but I love Camellia books, Camilla books. I love these books. They are awesome. I love pencil, how pencil work on this paper. I just, I love the book and Halloween is coming up. I'm so happy. I have several uh, illustrations in this book that I want to do for the month of Halloween. Can't wait. I love this. I love this book. And that's my little guy that I did. I used Arteza pencils, glitterific, um, glitter paint and black Posca, I think. This is cute and creepy. I love this book. Love it. And for some reason, it's like I have been dying to color something in that book lately. This is my favorite color by number. This is Glorious Gardens. Love this book. Um, I think I did two in this book. I'm not quite finished with the second, but I did this. I'm real happy how it turned out. I use Prismacolor pencils. Um, I love this book. This is my favorite color by number. And this is, of course, is by George Tafix. This is in Creative Haven. My new favorite is one of my new favorites is mandalas and chill because the mandalas in this book are so different than your typical mandalas. I love it. I love this book. Um, the link will be below for you to go and purchase this book. And there is also a full flip through of this book on my channel. Check it out. This is a book. If you like mandalas, you need to have this book. It's awesome. It's small. You can fit it in your purse. Take it on the go. I, I just love everything about this book. This is an awesome book. Mandalas and Chill. 
All the links will be below. And my all-time favorite, and I say this all the time, you guys know that um, I have several copies of this book, World of Flowers is just... It's my favorite book. I love botanicals. And this is my all-time favorite book. I love it. Everything about it. I have several pages marked because it's things I want to complete. Um, I have a lot of uh, completed pages in this book. But they are all in my... No, I've not, I have not covered anything in this book. Well, I think I did one. But they are all in my other book. I think I did one in this book. Yeah, I did this one in this book. But um, I definitely want to color this illustration again. I use Prisma and chalk pastels for the background. And that's it. I love how this turned out. But I have a lot of pages finished in this book, but it's in my other book. I love this. My all-time favorite. And last but not least is my new favorite book of all, Circle of Life. I even like this better than World of Flowers right now. Um, so this is my new favorite. I love this book. Everything about it is just awesome. The line art is what I like. I love super dark line art. This is it, bold line art. I completed a page in this book. Not too long ago. And book for last month. And I love how it turned out. It was super awesome. I used uh, Prismacolor pencils. White um, Sakura Decrease uh, gel pen. And I also used, which I forgot to tell you guys on the other video uh, when I did my finished pages. Around the earth or whatever this is. Um the moon, I used Faber-Castell pit pen. And I have a whole set of these pit pens. They are amazing. They are not cheap, but they are amazing for making this super, super white. Um, they were great. So that's what I used in this book. I love it. Um, I'm definitely um, starting a project in this for this month. Guys, if you have any questions about any book, feel free to drop a comment. I am going to try to link. No, I'll have all of them linked below, except for Clara Markova. You can get that on Etsy, but I'll also put that link below as well. Thank you for watching. I hope you have a great day. Happy National Coloring Book Day. Guys, I will see you soon.